Here we have a Asus UX430U and it sometimes turns on, sometimes it doesn't from the battery source but it does not matter if it's plugged in or not as long as the battery is connected uh, even with the charger sometimes it will turn on sometimes it will not and um, including from a standby sometimes it will boot sometimes it will not now this laptop may have had a liquid spill which I'm going to first inspect if it is so and if it is then check the components if they're working fine so we just go ahead and in this video I'm going to show you how to just disassemble the uh, laptop and pull the motherboard out if you need to work on this model and simply remove a bunch of screws around it including two under the caps on the top right and left The only marks of liquid spill I can see barely because it's been a while around these MOSFETs here and which could relate to charging controller I am not sure. There is no schematics available unfortunately but there are a bunch of uh, MOSFETs there and if I'm checking with multimeter they all seem to be working fine so it's really hard to pinpoint the problem and I did do a BIOS update on this and the issue shows up again so I'm going to replace the battery sometime today or tomorrow and let's see if the problem repeats itself or not. The battery connector has a metal clip which you need to move towards the left before you start lifting up the battery connector.
You do not need to remove the sand to remove the motherboard, which I attempted to do slightly. You will see that it's slightly removed, but you don't need to. You need to actually uh, loosen the hinges on the right side, and the motherboard will come loose easily. So ignore what I've done on the left side here. So it just, as you can see there, two screws on the top right side, loosen them a little bit more and maybe open the hinge a little bit more and the motherboard will just fall out of its place. Thank you for watching, see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to support this channel.